Hey there, Geeks. Tim with MajorGeeks.com. Today we're going to show you how to enable the Windows 10 Insider program without a Microsoft account. Before I get started, I just want to warn you, I'm not sure how Microsoft's going to feel about this, so they may close this loophole at some point. But until then, here we go. The Insider program is what I run on my test box. You can see right here, Insider Preview. And to do that, you have to go to your Start Settings, Update, and inside of there you can find the option to enable the Windows Insider program and you have to be logged in with a Microsoft account until now. So go ahead and download this file. The video will be in the or the description will be in the video up here. There'll be a little eye pops up, click on that, and it'll jump you through. I'll take you right to the download page. When you get here, just click download now or choose one of the mirrors. And you'll get a zip file. It's portable. And you extract the files just like that. And you have a README, a license, but what you're looking for is Offline, Insider, Enroll. Really, really easy to use. Right click, Run as Administrator. If you have your user control, account control prompts on, you need to click Yes. And there it is. So all you got to do is choose to enroll to Dev, Beta, or Release Preview. I believe these are in order. Dev is going to be the probably, I hate to use the word risky, but the most recent updates the beta is going to be less frequently updated and the release preview will be even less frequently updated so you shouldn't use this on a production machine anyway you should use virtual machine which is what I'm in right here so you have your choices one two or three stop receiving insider builds and quit without making changes so you can pick whatever you want press the number applying your changes press any key and you're done go to your Windows updates and you can get your updates from there and move into the preview build. Let's take a look here. I haven't looked in a while. There it is, the Windows Insider program. So start settings, update and security. Scroll on down to the Windows Insider program. Now, as you can see, I've applied myself to the dev ch channel and you are good to go. So you could actually, if you wanted to, I would assume you could check for updates once you've installed it. I shouldn't have anything so I think I just updated this build. And there you go. It really simplifies the process and it uses again, keep in mind, an undocumented registry entry. So if Microsoft closes that loophole and you're watching this video and it doesn't work, then you know why. Pretty easy, right? There you have it. Bottom right corner, Major Geeks logo. Click subscribe if you want. We'd appreciate that. And we appreciate you taking the time to spend a few minutes with Major Geeks. See ya.